Welcome to our channel. Today, we'll be diving into managing BitLocker using PowerShell. Before start, right-click on the Windows logo key and choose Windows PowerShell Admin. To begin, let's enable BitLocker on a drive with the following enable BitLocker command. For example, dollar secure string equals convert to secure string 12345678 as plain text force. Enable BitLocker, mount point H, password protector, password dollar secure string. These two commands initialize BitLocker encryption on the H, drive with the password 12345678. Next, to check the BitLocker status, execute the command below. Get BitLocker volume, mount point E. This displays the encryption status and key protectors for the E, drive. For convenience, you can also enable auto unlock with the command. Enable BitLocker auto unlock, mount point E. Remember, this requires the operating system drive to be encrypted first. To temporarily suspend protection, use Suspend BitLocker, mount point E. This is useful during updates or maintenance. To resume protection, simply run the command Resume BitLocker, mount point E. And when you need to disable BitLocker protection, use following command Disable BitLocker, mount point H. Make sure to clear any auto unlock keys first. That wraps up our guide on managing BitLocker with PowerShell. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech tips.